Oh, I don't have foundation on. In order to get back to looking normal. Cause girl, the complexion. We're going to mix all of my foundations. And then we're going to apply it to my face. I saw this video the other day on YouTube and I thought it was so funny. Let's just so, get started. This is where I keep my foundations. And then I also have some up here. Right here. So we're just gonna mix all of them into this bowl. It looks really nice. It's like nice and creamy. So let's see what it looks like on the face. Alrighty, so we're gonna put up these hairs. So here it is. What I'm going to do first is one side with a brush, and then I will do the other side with a damp beauty sponge. Let's start off with the synthetic brush. I'm just gonna, ugh, should I dot it all over my face? Whatever. I use the Tarte Primer to prime the skin. Oh my god, I grab so much. Okay, so I'm just gonna go in here. It looks so thick. Oh! Oh! Uh oh, I should have went with less. Girl, I'm gonna be here blending for days. I mean, it's super glowy, which I love. It looks really illuminating. In certain spots, it's making me look really old, but I don't know if it's just because I literally put way too much. If I went over it with a sponge to soak up the excess, it would look a lot better. That looks a million times better. Are you kidding me right now? <laughs> oh my gosh. This looks so... I, <laughs> I am shooketh to the core. This looks so good. Okay, I totally don't recommend it with a brush. Just caked it on and I probably grabbed too much, but Oh my god, this literally looks like my skin. I am dumbfounded. <gasps> I can just scream, this is so cool. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna do the other side. <laughs> this is just crazy to me. The fact that Mixing all of your foundations looks like this is just absolutely crazy to me. Because you would think that it would be so cakey and just so thick and disgusting, but it's the complete opposite. I am shock. <laughs> ah! I literally can't believe a deal. Okay, so <laughs> let me go throw on some brows and then I'll be right back. I am shocked that it looks so natural and so glowy. I don't know if you guys can see like the natural glow that it gives. I think I'm gonna have to start doing this for now on so that my skin looks like this all the time. I really enjoy it. I'm gonna do the rest of my makeup and then see how that goes. All the products that I used, I will list in the description box down below, so make sure you check that out. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I'm still just in awe. I can't believe it. It's just so insane to me that it looks this good. I definitely recommend doing it with a sponge. The synthetic brush kind of laid it on too thick, 
and it kind of made it look really cakey but once I went over it with a sponge it definitely looked a million times better I think it's because it has a little bit more of that moisture to it so I totally recommend it with a sponge instead I have found it some foundations I like with a sponge and some foundations I like with a brush so I mean it depends on the foundation it depends on your mood and it depends on preference so I definitely recommend using a sponge. If you guys liked this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you guys try this out, let me know in the comments down below. Yeah, girl. Till next time, I'll talk to you guys later.